close to the island, we're using fish to attract the crocodiles in. If one of these crocs does decide to get a little bit too close or show a little bit too much interest, then the only defense I have is to bump it on the snout with this. It's really important when you're doing something like this to keep yourself calm, keep your heart rate and your breathing down. As long as I'm calm and confident, then you'll see me as an equal and not as something you might want to eat. Mateus's stick seems a bit feeble as a three metre long male glides towards us. Even a croc of this size mostly feeds on fish. He's targeting our bait at the surface. You really have to have your wits about you every single second you're in the water with crocodiles. That is such a sinister sight. He's coming towards us very much with an attitude that says, this is my patch, this is my territory. One quick snap from a crocodile of this size would easily be enough to lose an arm or a leg. Oh, that crunch of fish bones just being smashed. Best we back off a bit. This crop is moving very decisively towards us. Much more aggressive body movements. And it seems more interested in us than it does in the fish. Have you got another one? Yes. Another one? Oh wow. Okay, now that's a whole different ball game. We have yet another croc. And this one is in slightly murkier light. The, uh, the visibility is starting to drop a bit and the, the whole thing just goes up a notch. All of a sudden, there's far more sense of menace and threat and we are getting very, very edgy now. The water's stirring up, it's getting murky. It's much harder to see them. There are much more crocodiles around. You need eyes in the back of your head. The two rivals come side to side to assess who's biggest. The smaller croc makes a sharp exit. but then turns and faces up to us. It's exerting its dominance. It's proving who owns this space. And if you back off even for a second, then it's gonna try and bite. This would have to be one of the greatest wildlife encounters you could have anywhere in the world, sharing the sea with an American saltwater crocodile. Absolutely extraordinary. Coming nose to snout with a croc underwater is one of the finest of all wildlife encounters. In many places, these ancient creatures are endangered. But here on this Caribbean coral island, the crocs still rule. Wow, 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 wow. That was incredible. Look at him, he's up there at the surface now. That was spectacular. Well done, mate. Well done. You too, man. Good teamwork. <laughs>